Okay, today's science lesson. I bet you're wondering what this is. I found this on top of uh, my Martin house. I was cleaning the houses out today. And I found this on top and I was like, oh no. This is what's called an owl pellet. And judging from the size of it, <clears throat> came from a great horned owl. What it is, is owls can't digest the, the hair and the fur and all that stuff. So what happens is they end up with a, uh, a ball of undigested material stuck in their stomach. Which they have to literally, you know, throw up uh, before they can eat again. So this is an owl pellet. And you could tell what they're eating by... Uh, basically breaking down. Now, he must have been up there for a while, but I can tell right now that one of the things he has been eating is birds. Um, how do I know that? Well, see the hollow bone? There's a leg bone. This is a leg bone here. I think that's a femur, but that's a hollow bone. That's from a bird. So, uh, let's see, what else? There is the, the keel, if you can see it, or the breastbone of some small bird. That big hole in it was uh, him taking a big chunk out of it. Uh, there's a nail right there, toenail. Um, it's pretty hard. There's a bit of the skull there. Let's see what we can get out of here. Let's see. What is this? I wonder if that's a wing. No, that's it's another leg bone. That's a long leg bone. Another uh, part of a breast. These are long, thin bones. I, I wish I knew what it was. There's another... Uh, Claw. There's a foot. That's an entire foot there. See the toenails? What species? I don't know, man. Jeez. There's another one. Another foot. Entire foot. Oh, this thing is uh, hard. Oof. See, that's a skull there. Yeah, leg bone. I wish I knew what he was eating. Unfortunately, I couldn't tell you. That's the orbitals. It's around the eye. The bone that's around the eye. That's that's what that is. The orbitals. Man, there's no bits of rodent in here at all. This is all bird. Another breast, part of the breast, the keel. Ooh, there's a beak. E, 
I don't like that. That is, um... <clears throat> oh boy, that looks really purple martinish to me. That beak. Great. And we got... I was hoping the owl that was here was not eating these birds, but, uh... Looks like he may have been. I don't know. Ah, where did that go? Damn it. I don't find owl pellets all the time, <clears throat> but when I do, I like to go through it. To, you know, just to get an idea of what they've been eating here. There's that foot. Let's see, how many of those do we have? That's a long... Let's see, that's an orbital. There's a pelvis. Boy, he eats it bone and all. There's a second orbital. Bird's got big eyes. So I found one beak, one top half of the beak, two orbitals. I'm guessing this is one bird. What the heck is this part? Man, he just really... That gray stuff is what's left of the feathers. It's a leg or part of the wing or something. That's a bit of the skull. It's pretty amazing when you really think about it. This appears to be one bird. this it's like a bit of brown feather so maybe it wasn't a martin after all you know usually when there's rodents you find their teeth and their skulls These are a lot of, you know, look at these long bones. It's it's a bigger bird, but it's a dainty bird. There's the there's the other foot and the leg, so I'm thinking just one. That's part of the wing there. I'm pretty sure that's part of the wing. I wish I knew what species this guy was consuming. Yeah, these are the remains of one bird. I guess I probably should have been doing this with a set of gloves or whatever, but you know, I had a, I'm at a point in my life where I don't care. Man, what is this? Lots of little boat broken pieces. That's the back. That's part of the back. Um, the base where the tail is. Part that's part of it. How do I know these things? I. Just, I've taken apart a lot of dead animals in my life. I know how to identify things. There's a uh, the keel of the breastbone again. You can see it, the sharp keel. Oh man, just uh, yeah. There's a there's a joint. Looks could be a knee, could be the part of the arm. I, I'm not familiar. I'm not. 
quite sure. Just know it's a joint. Yeah, this is one meal. This is just one. I wish I knew what he ate. That's what concerns me. There's another toenail. Another yeah, butt. It's just bits of pieces of bone. Feather shaft. No. That's bone. It's a shard of bone. Okay, well, what do we got there? Man, I mean, nothing left. Well, I know it wasn't a small bird. It was like the size of a mouse or something. He could have swallowed it whole. And he didn't do that. Because there's bone shards. Oh boy. Well, I don't know. Makes me wonder. What was this? It wasn't a really large bird. It wasn't a real small one either. Jeez, I'm, I'm even going to guess it might have been a Martin. Judging on the top of this skull. But you never know. It is about the size of her feet, though. So, it's very possible. And that's part of the leg, the upper leg, where it goes into the hip. Well, so much for that. Yep, one complete bird. Yep. Wish I could find that part of the beak. I'm guessing this was a Martin he ate. There it is. No, no, that's... What is that? It's a shard from a long bone. All right. So much for your science lesson today, huh, boys and girls? Dissecting an owl pellet. This is a big eye. Judging at it or orbital around the eye. Man, I'm gonna. I'm willing to say this is probably a martin. I, I hate to say it, but I bet that son of a bitch ate a purple martin. Oh, the fun never ends. It just never ends. Well, no DNA test. It's the only way to know for sure. But that's my guess. All right. So much for the science lesson.